I'm here with Ian Eightpack Parry, Overclockers UK's overclocking guru and the author of the Eightpack Systems from Overclockers. Eightpack, can you talk us through uh, this machine? Um, I believe it's a supernova and uh, a little bit about its history. Yeah, this is uh, the third incarnation of the supernova. Uh, the supernova being the top of the range Eightpack system, which are the flagship systems here at OCUK. UK. Uh, the first supernova was based on X79 and 3930K CPU. Uh, the second supernova was uh, again X79 4930K CPU, and now uh, on the on the uh, if you like bringing to the market of X99, we've again updated the supernova specs to incorporate X99, uh, an extreme chip this time in the 5960X uh, DDR4, of course, and with that uh, four GTX 980 GPUs, all the system entirely overclocked. Obviously, uh, the, the case is built and modded, the liquid cooling's in place, and quite a lot of the uh, overclocking of the system itself and testing of the overclocks uh, has been done. CPUs overclocked, memory overclocked, and graphics cards overclocked. The cooling system, it, which is on the Aquara, has, has all been uh, set up so that as the loads placed on the components, the fans kick up accordingly, all this kind of thing. Also, each, each uh, component has then been stress tested. Uh, the system's also been benchmarked as well for maximal scores. Uh, and and uh, some of the drivers have been tweaked for efficiency. So we're, we're at that stage now. We just need to add the front panel here, some of the, some of the other panels, uh, the limited edition plaque, um, load up some profiles into BIOS, you know, some recovery type stuff, and then uh, pack in for the customer, essentially. Obviously the Supernova is the flagship build, so it's always, it's always three or four graphics cards. With this incarnation, four graphics cards, but some people want, say, EVGA Classified, other people want uh, Zotac Amp. Always a high-end type of card, but then that comes with it different challenges in terms of water blocks, availability, uh, availability of our stocks. Many hundreds of components actually go into this. Uh, some of it very specialised water cooling stuff. So a supernova can take anything from around a week to build to up to a month to build, or even beyond that if the customer wants some sort of crazy paint job, different etching on the window, uh, different type of grills, e e you know, everything in the machine is customizable. This case here is uh, by Case Labs, uh, and it comes totally flat packed, uh, and we, uh, we put to get we put the case together here uh, on site, yeah. But I mean, if someone wants a, a certain custom paint job, it's actually better to send it to the powder cuts, have them do their work before we even start. So this can obviously put a lead time on the build. Most people who are using the systems at the moment are like gamers. You know, they like gaming over multiple monitors. Uh, uh, some, some people have bought it with like the Emperor chair, which is a, a very bespoke solution where you can sit back three or four monitors in front of you. Uh, surround sound system like very much an entertainment system but other people have bought it for like encoding uh, just general uses of a PC but faster and you know and more powerful well I mean obviously at the moment the Intel CPU is by far the superior so you're gonna you, you have to go Intel initially uh, the X99 is is the the enthusiast socket and it's the the most efficient one when used for uh, media type application. Everyone knows Zen 97 has got a very good place in gaming. It, it's great for one or two cards, but for, for when you're using three or four cards, you need the bandwidth on the CPU. And the best CPU in terms of threads and, um, and cores is the, the XCPU. So we take the XCPU and we, we buy many and bin until we find very good ones for these systems, typically like probably the top 10% in these systems. You know, anything comes out, it can handle it. Uh, and that's how it will ev you know, it's evolve. It's our, it's our um, flagship system. It will always be the, you know, the, top of the, the top of the top, if you like. And hopefully in the next couple of weeks, I'll be start testing Titan X. Um, I mean, it'll take a while for the water cool inside to catch up, but as soon as, the, as soon as it does, then we'll look at three or four Titan X in this system and probably in the Polaris as well.